Hello out there. You may be wondering why I decided to post another blog about the WWE. Well, I was searching around and found out my first blog was featured on a WWE fan site, which is pretty damn astounding. So, this is the benefit of all those who heard about me my thoughts or just want to see me do a blog or just came to hear an opinion. Anyone who even wants to watch this basically or doesn't anyone watching this, thank you for watching. Well first of all, when I feel I've been getting a lot of questions on my Gmail and on my Twitter, my Facebook, I've been getting a lot of messages ever since the first blog. I just decided as soon as I would get enough uh, questions, I would uh, make another one of these videos. Yep. Well, let's see. First of all, all these uh, people are going to be anonymous because I've guaranteed them their anonymity will be uh, kept. So. Let's see, first one asks, what do you think about Santino being the United States Champion? What do I think about Santino being the United States Champion? First of all, I like the United States Championship. It's a good belt. I actually have my own little United States Championship I made back when I was a little younger. It's made out of cardboard. I still have it. It's right here. See? It's the United States Championship belt. <laughs> I made it when I was a little younger. It was, uh, it still fits me too. It's cool. And, uh, yeah. What do I think about Santino holding the belt? I think WWE is finally getting things right. Santino holding the belt is pretty good. It also kind of speaks about something. Santino won the belt and held the belt in the Northeast. And nothing against the Italians in the Northeast, but guess what? It seems 75% of the people in my state are Italian, or of Italian, Italian descent. So it's kind of saying something, but at the same time, it really pushes Santino. I was actually begging for a Santino push. I wanted to see Santino back in action. He's going to WrestleMania, no matter what you do now, because... He's a champion, and all championships are going to be fought for at WrestleMania. They always have been. <clears throat> Second question. Do you think Zack Ryder deserves to be on Team Teddy? Well, honestly, I feel Zack Ryder is a pretty uh, unused character. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of a fan of Zack Ryder. I mean... I would love to see him be WWE Champion, World Heavyweight Champion, for at least like a month, maybe a week, I don't care. But, uh, him being on Team Teddy, I completely approve. Guess what, Zack Ryder, you have the JS Handle seal of approval. LOL! <laughs> Alright, uh, back to it. Okay, third question asks... We understand that you collect toy belts. Could you show them to us? I really don't want to because it's kind of boring, but this guy wants to show him. I'll go grab him. Here's my belts. I have one half of the old raw tag team belts. 
I really liked these belts back when they were used. I thought having a set of belts on each show would be pretty cool because then the tag team champions on SmackDown and the tag team champions on Raw could battle each other to see who's the best tag team. That would have been a great script. I have the WWE Spinner Championship. I don't mind the belt. I know a lot of the older fans my age hate the belt. I don't mind it. I think it's just, you know, my shirt. My shirt has the spin belt on. See? It's, I uh, have a CM Punk written on the nameplate and a washable marker. That way, if CM Punk ever loses, I can just change the name. I like CM Punk. Always good. Uh, my newest belt I got when SmackDown came to Mohegan Sun. The World Heavyweight Championship belt. I like it. it you can see the shine. It, it feels good on the shoulder. It feels nice and it's a little, you know, stiff, but I'm going to try to free it up. And the last belt I have is the old school WWF championship. I wasn't around when this belt was used, but really it's part of WWE history. Andre the Giant held this belt. Bret Hart held this belt. Not this belt per se, but the actual belt. This is a crafty creation. I do have the Pride Championship, but that is not WWE. It is my new, it is a internet championship I'm working on. As you can see, I already have the plates set up. Zach Ryder, YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook. So I, all I need to do is make the uh, main plate. All right. Next question is. You could wrestle any superstar, past or present, or even future, who would it be? If I could wrestle against anyone, I'd have to say I want to beat the ever-loving shit out of Daniel Bryan. Cody Rhodes, I used to not be able to stand, but I haven't seen Rhodes in action for a while, so I believe that they've been forgetting Rhodes, which makes me happy. Uh, okay. Next question. Who is your favorite superstar on each show? Uh, NXT, I like Alex Riley. Raw, CM Punk. SmackDown, Randy Orton. Superstars, Yoshi Tatsu. You gotta love the Yoshi. You gotta love Tatsu. You gotta love Tatsu. <laughs> J-pop. Drop it. I'm sorry. Uh, alright. Next question. Do you like bananas? You go to the moon, bitch. You go to the moon. Okay. Next one. Do you think that any of the WWE superstars are bronies? Mm. John Cena has done almost a rarity esque whining thing. But that's too obvious. If anything, any of the superstars, I mean, Zack Ryder could be a brownie for all we know. Okay, last question for the day, because I gotta get going soon, I gotta head up to a buddy's house. Last question, and I'll give you my honest opinion on WWE. State of WWE dress. Well, okay. 
If you could fight for any title, what title would it be and why? Well, if I could wrestle for any title, I'd ha I'd actually want to go for the tag team titles, you know. Because then you get help from a guy, you know. That way you can have a little you know, you can have help in the ring no matter what and you won't get disqualified. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now my state of the WWE dress. Well, John Laurinaitis is reign is probably going to end at WrestleMania. Yes. As soon as Teddy takes over both shows, WWE's gonna write itself out again. And everything. The Rock vs. Cena WrestleMania match is a dream of mine. I've always, in SmackDown 2010, I've, I've always put The Rock vs. Cena just to see who would win. It was The Rock every freaking time. Team Brand, baby. Team Brand. And if you're wondering before you ask me the question, I'm on Team Brand. I don't like Simulation. I don't like little PG ears. I have nothing against the people who watch WWE and the PG, but really, WWE sucks. I like World Wrestling Federation. Yes. Do you hear me, World Wildlife Fund? World Wrestling Federation. The real WWF. Alright. Peace out. And make sure you hit that subscribe button right up there. Subscribers and comments, the only reason I keep these blogs going. Alright. And then PewDiePie style. Charging. Charging it. Charging it. Bye.